down the wall. I'll tell you, this stemmed from not being able to do something. So I was, I'm like, okay, I'll hold a handstand and hopefully tap side to side, but I could not hold my body weight for the leg coming up on the side. So I had to make a modification. So this right here, it'll be handstand against the wall, and I'll show you it. Um, but make sure right here that if you have a wall, you don't want to get dirty, take your shoes off, okay? I would try to respect whatever facility you're at um, and take your shoes off. So big thing with handstand right here. You want to walk up and down. So when you walk up and down, you want to make sure your torso is tight the entire time. So you don't want to be caved like this. You don't want to be caved like this. We want to keep this guy strong the entire time. So you want to go out however comfortable you feel going out. That's just a few steps. That's okay. But I don't want you going too far and then falling or just not trusting yourself. You can do more than you think. So try to press the line a little bit, okay? Try to go a little bit farther each time. Then gradually work your way out where you're feeling a little bit confident with it. So what you want to do, you're going to walk up the wall. So we're starting here. your brain going. Um, so go out as far as you can. That's not far. Like me, I wasn't far at all. That's okay. If you can build it up, you have a distance to kind of shoot for next, okay? Make sure to just walk your hands out, then walk your hands back, okay? Trust yourself that you can do this. I promise you. Just work on it. We gotta be able to use, like, use our body in ways that we're not used to using, okay? So just really work on this, and I promise you it'll pay off in the long run.